these principles in marketing i i got from uh, my experience experience doing business and also reading numerous books that i find um applicable in today's world So first, what you think is different from what your customers think. What your experiences, past experiences, your your personal biases dictates what you think, what your customers would want. But in the real world, what you think is uh, bias on your personal pre pre preferences, and your customers has have different different perspective of things so that gap uh, result in risks so uh, risks are uh, un uncertainty or consequences of that uncertainty in activities that we do so uh, in marketing or in business in general we minimize those risks through learning and that learning can be made through market research market research i cannot emphasize uh more um market research is your ticket in minimizing those risks you don't want to enter in a business wherein you didn't study your market or or you don't know what the customers want or at least you don't have um the 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 information of what your competitors do currently so with that you'll be doing business blindly you don't want to do that the risks are so high uh now more now because of the, the technology and, and the the fast or rapid changes in the business environment uh in the philippines and also in other countries most especially in other countries so we minimize those risks to learning and that the, the the number one risk in business is market risk or the risk of selling something that no one wants you don't want to plan plan and plan and when you implement your plan that you did for months uh you will learn that what you plan isn't really what your customers want so you want to plan agile meaning you plan based on feedback based on market sentiments and then market uh, research and actionable market research now based on that uh nowadays entrepreneurs want to or, or new entrepreneurs want to do everything uh i also experienced that when i'm starting in business want to do everything i uh, want to have a hands-on uh, approach to every aspect of the business but uh as i experience uh starting different businesses and managing and consulting with others you know you would spread spread your 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 time your effort and uh, your resources thinly when you try to do everything so in my personal learning, you try to focus on your strengths and then delegate if you have staff or at least outsource the rest. It's better to outsource one because when you outsource, you save uh, somehow because you're paying specialists on, on certain tasks. Or if you delegate, you can focus on what you do best. So if you're, if you're good at uh, the marketing or the operations aspect of your business try to uh try to outsource at least the finance if you don't uh you don't know how to efficiently do that uh, it, it pays when you learn you know the basics but 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 when the the nitty-gritty of the things you need to do you need to at least delegate or outsource for uh better allocation of uh, of time effort and your resources and my my number one principle 
in executing business plans, most especially in marketing plan, is uh, start small, act fast, but always think big. Um, the, the misconception in starting small is that you don't have any dreams of growing big. So my my, my personal experience is is, is that. Uh, you don't. You want to try small first, and then and then get some learnings. After that, iterate another campaign, another iteration of of your market research. Implement what what you've learned in the first iteration, and then continue to improve until you perfect a system, a system that would sustain it on itself. But uh, you need to be stubborn on your vision, meaning the goal, the long-term goal of your of your business, and be flexible on the details. So uh, that's usually the case. Um, what you thought of initially um, wouldn't be implemented uh, months forward or or weeks after. So it's better to get feedback. From your customers, from your market, and then be flexible on details, uh, adapt on the market, but still be mindful of your long-term vision. If you have a, a big, audacious goal of becoming an empire, be mindful of that, but but be flexible on uh, flexible on details. So that is the four principles I follow in terms of uh, doing marketing.